if we weren't streaming, I would tell you guys about it. And just swirling your tongue around the head. Uh. Gold. Come on, buddy. How about, like, uh, masturbation stories? How about those? Okay, how about the story of where I thought my dad caught me masturbating when I was a kid? <laughs> and I was asleep. And the whole day I thought he thought, I thought he caught me masturbating. Wait, you were sleep jerking it? No, no, okay, alright. So here's how the story begins. It's like midnight, you know, I, I, when I was a kid I would always stay up to like midnight and then get up at 7am, school started at 730 and I literally, it was like, school was like half a block from my house. So I'd get up, get showered, leave, walk out the door and get to school. So, I would get up, or I'd go to sleep around midnight. So at like, fucking three or four in the morning, sometime in the middle of the fucking night when I'm deep, my dad slams on my door, just pounds the living shit out of it. For no fucking reason. And I'm confused. Because I have no idea what just happened. Other than... Buddy's leaving. He's tired of story time. Bye, buddy. Um, so, I'm confused. I'm like, what the hell's going on? I'm so tired that I'm not even going to bother with, you know, yelling or screaming or whatever. And, uh... And so, I just go back to sleep. So in the morning I wake up and my dad, he's like, him and my mom were in the kitchen and they were talking. And I, I just sit there listening to him for a little bit. My dad's like, yeah, you know I caught the kid up at like 3 o'clock playing with his thing. And I'm like, what the fuck is he talking? Because I'm 18, so I'm in in the bed in a bedroom finally. And I'm like, what the fuck is he like creeping on me, opening the door, and I'm like playing with my dick in the middle of the night? Is that why he like pounded on the door or something? And then I, uh, and then like, so the entire day at school, I'm thinking, I'm like, do you guys like walk in on me jerking off? That's like creepy as shit. So, I'm just like flipping out about it the entire day. And then, uh, so I get home, nothing, you know, my dad doesn't bring it up, nothing. Nothing happens, nothing happens, nothing happens. So finally dinner time rolls around. Um, and we used to sit down as a family and actually have dinner. Back in those days. Um, and my dad... He's like, yeah, you, so what, were you up late playing with your video game things in there? Ah. And I'm like, oh, you thought I was on my fucking computer. He's like, and I'm like, no, I, I was asleep. You woke me up when you banged on my door. He's like, no, I heard noises coming. I'm like, dad, you realize there's somebody that lives like three, well, like five feet from us that had probably had their window open and may have been watching TV or something and I was asleep with my window open because I like the cool air so apparently he heard my neighbor's TV or something and thought it was my video games playing in the middle of the night so he decided he was going to smash my door scared the shit out of me and made me think I was he caught me jerking off. So, yeah, that's the end of that story. Do you ever have post-traumatic jerking disorder? You're like masturbating and then you hear like loud knocking at your door? You associate the two things? Or you see something that really turns you on and like... You imagine your dad? Violently knocking. <laughs> no. You mean like plastic conditioning? Yeah, exactly. Like the telltale no. heart. Your dad is thumping. No, not really. I've been classically conditioned before. Unfortunately, but not in that way. 
please do tell. Uh, I used to get, like, angry phone calls from a friend I had a long time ago. So whenever the phone would ring, my heart would pound faster and faster. And that still sort of happens to this day. I still see it one stimulus with the other. <laughs> Even though I know what's going on, I can't, uh, well, I can sort of calm myself down, but it still happens immediately. So what you're saying is I should call you? No. <laughs> well, my phone, cell phone doesn't work out here, so... Uh, sure. Shit. Huh. It doesn't, it doesn't have the same effect on Skype, only on, uh, only on one of those, like, uh, old corded phones. old shitty phones. That, like, like sheer fucking ring. ring. Sexy Walker? gifts of black women every time I call. Sexy what, in the background? Sexy gifts of black women. Oh, uh, no. Oh, every time I call. Small black man. So do you have a, do you have a masturbation story, Kirby? No, not really. No? Not really anything all that interesting. Uh... Do you have another story of the sexual nature? <laughs> um... What's with you and girlfriends and sex today? Maybe you need to jerk off. No, I'm not... I'm not in that kind of mood. I'm just, uh... Thinking of a topic, and that's what I came up Fishing. with. Fishing for topics. Yeah. Um, I try to focus people's minds on one category. Alright, the first time that I uh, ever realized that like I could sort of jerk off, like I understood the mechanics of the movement, or began to understand the mechanics of the movement. How old were um, you? Sorry. Middle school. Okay. Really? Uh, yeah. So was I. It was early middle school. And, uh, yeah, that's where my shit comes into effect. I was watching an episode of The Apprentice. And I don't remember what season. But there's this hot chick on The Apprentice. And, the Apprentice? Uh, <laughs> I got this raging erection for no reason. And uh, I started like grabbing my dick, and I, I, I realized sort of what I needed to do, and it all clicked, and I have Donald Trump to thank for that. Nice. Did you ejaculate the first time you jerked off? No, no, I waited a couple months, because I was always afraid. Fr so you just, like, blue-balled yourself? I would, I would edge, without knowing what that was. <laughs> you would, oh, you would like... what? Edge? Edge. <laughs> He, yeah. he blue-balled himself, basically, <laughs> for two months. Ah. But, so the first time you orgasm, you ejaculated, though. Um, whatever it was then was not the same as what, what became. Yeah. Yeah, but, but you, you spurted some white substance from your penis. Right, but it was not... Uh... Like the early stuff was not was not the same potency as what came later. Right, right. Yeah, no, I understand. Same thing for me. Yeah. Or was like, it as difficult to clean up? Which I realized. I know. God. That was that was a terrible realization that that ha when that happened. The whole cleaning up thing. Yeah. Yeah. I was not happy about that. But that's uh that's the origin. Or origin stories, Kirby. Yeah. So <laughs> you gonna talk about your origin? Sean Crandall. I don't remember. You don't remember the first time you jerked off? No, I don't. And orgasmed? I remember uh the first time around like the first times I was doing it. And then I did and I ejac I could ejaculate about thirty to forty times at once. And that's not an exaggeration either. Yeah, that's just weird. Well, that's what I did, and then my penis was very raw. 
Bloody. He's getting that shit up. Yeah. Nice. Wow. That, my, I remember. My... I remember when I was a teenager. I think I jerked off so long in the shower once that um, I went swimming in a lake a few like a couple days later or the next day or something. And uh, and like it burned my wiener to swim. I had to get out of the lake. <laughs> Damn. I was like, why does it burn? No. The lake I burn. think I burst a blood vessel once. Oh, let's hear about or this. Something. I hit my record of 13 times, and after that, I never did that again. Oh, uh, dude, I've never gone that high, but I have jerked off so frequently and often that I, like, my penis was swollen for days. Yeah, yeah, I had that <laughs> when I was a kid, yeah. Whenever I started. No, that That's was like, secret, that was like last year. I was like, I think my dick's broke. <laughs> I was like, why? And I'm like, because it's all swollen. I don't know what's wrong with it. <laughs> That's a good thing, man. <laughs> and then, like, so I, I had, I Googled it, of course, because Google knows everything. And, uh, and, like, I read a bunch of the comments on, like, uh, on, like, uh, swollen penis after masturbation. Da -da -da. And I'm like, oh, I must have just, like, you know, done something to aggravate it. It'll go away in a few days, and then in a few days it went away. So, yeah, that, that sucked so bad. I think that was during the time that I was on pills, too. And when I was on pills, I it was very, very hard for me to finish so I could sit there for an hour and just keep going at it just try to finish 